Maybe someone's thrown a brick for the chicky window. What? When? Well, how do I know? I'm going to bed. Uh, Christmas Eve lunch, my place, half twelve. We're, we're busy. Would you want to tell Ben that yourself? Because uh, it was his idea. And when did you decide that? And uh, Shirley's cooking. And you wouldn't want to miss that, would you? <laughs> One of crisps constituted lunch. Hi. Hey. Come and see the end of us coming. Hey, Ian. Jane, hi. Oh, not long now. No. <laughs> right, listen, I've just put Amy down. Who wants a drink? Oh, yeah, I'll have a, a glass of that one. Let's see a drink, lovely. Right. Wait, another day of her without Jack. I think we'd explode. What did you say? Nothing. Oh, you look gorgeous in that outfit. I look even more gorgeous out of it. Why don't you come round later and I'll show you? Sure, you can squeeze me in. That sausage roll. I'll uh, take your word, Rip. I think I'll pass. <laughs> you and the Bill. I know you dirty little secret. Yeah? Well, maybe Shirley would like to know yours. I'd like to see you try. And let's see what happens to that pretty little neck of yours this time. So, Pete, how'd you enjoy the party last week? Yeah, it was great, thanks. But you were smashed, Pete. Yeah, well, I rather just forgot about it. Only Glenda was saying that you went around to see her afterwards. Ain't it right, Glenda? Phil. And pushed you down the stairs. What, is that meant to be funny? I don't know. Hey, why don't you tell us? Was it meant to be funny? Huh? I don't know how you get your kicks sometimes, Phil. Jane, but just, no, just no, leave no, it. No, he's standing there accusing him. Well, ask Glenda. She'll tell you. It was dark. What, I thought you said that Peter told you it was him that pushed you down the stairs. Come on, Jane, we should be leaving. No, not until Phil apologises. Let, let's just forget the whole thing. Peter? She deserved everything she got. You pushed my mum down the stairs. Peter? No. I thought you were just drunk. Now, why would you do a thing like that? Hey, Pete? Bobby! Bobby, we're leaving! <laughs> Next time you want to play on Kung Fu, you get someone else to cook your sausage rolls. She was in a neck brace, Peter. Oh, Jane, please, just, just leave it, yeah? I can't believe you'd push a woman down the stairs. Yeah, yeah but she's not pressing charges, is she? That makes it all right, does it? Um, shouldn't you be getting off to your concert? What well, do you think I can sing after this? Love, love, you're going to be fine, OK? You'll enjoy yourself. I'll be all right talking to Peter. Come on. Mm -hmm. it, just let me talk to him. I just don't get why he'd do it. Glenda told me this morning that he tried it on with her at Ben's party. Peter? But Glenda? Well, look, Whitney had just knocked him back and I guess she, she was there. I mean, love, he's only 17. So he goes and... Throws her down the stairs? Look, I'll, um, I'll <gasps> talk to him, OK? I'll deal with it. You get yourself a few cards at you. Come on. <laughs> okay. You make me sick. Oh, Peter, please. You let me sit there and take the rap for something. No, I didn't even do. Look, you, you told Glenda. I told her nothing. I wanted a scare. I wanted a scare from you. Jane loves you. I don't know why, but she does. Oh, Peter, please. You really don't care about anyone, do you? Everyone who loves you, you just drive them away. That's not true. Ask Stephen. No, ask Lucy. All I wanted from you today was for you to defend me. For you to be my dad. I am your dad. You're trying to get me to lie about the abortion. The affair. What that does that? Okay, I'll, I'll tell her, okay? But you won't. 
You disgust me. You don't mean that. You don't like that. Oh, Peter, please, don't say that. Peter. All right. All right, I'll, I'll do whatever you want, OK? I'll tell her. Just, just forgive me, please, yeah? I'm gonna go stay with Lucy. <laughs> I'm gonna miss my train. Will you tell Glenda that? Well, it won't me.